you doing? It's Kwa here. In this video, we're going to be covering uh, just a quick update on what's happening, and uh, just really want to share with you that um, you know, there's some days when you, know, you feel like you're you're doing a lot of things, right? You're really productive, you're getting stuff done, feels really good. But there's obviously, as you know, uh, there's some days where you just don't feel like it. You know, no, despite what's happening in your life, you feel that you know you're doing stuff, you're getting there, you're moving, but you just you're just not feeling it. You're just not feeling it. And today is one of those days. I'm just not feeling it today. Um, you know, I, I've managed to do my deep work. I'm reading my, my books, did my one hour of reading of real estate. Uh, did some study on Google Ads and also Facebook as well. I uh, got some editing done. So, I'm, 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 yeah, I'm getting there. But I just feel that it's just things aren't moving ahead. Things aren't moving forward. So, um, but, you know, times like this, I just, um, I go back to the quote that I'm going to share with you in this video, and uh, it's really helped me, so I thought that I'll just teach this at the same time as well. So, uh, the quote is, to show up, despite what's going on in your life, despite what's happening, uh, whether you're going up, or going down, whatever it is, just got to keep showing up. So, this is one of those days where I just don't feel like it. I don't feel like it, don't want to do anything I want to do, I don't want to make these videos, I don't want to... Uh, you know, uh, create these the, this content. Don't want to be able to, you know, move towards the goals. Whatever it is, right? We we all go through that. So it's like an emotional state I'm feeling right now. But the thing is that you just still got to show up. So my 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 philosophy is that um, you can't get ahead or anything without showing up. So let's say that I'm just going to try and do some sort of timeline here. Maybe I should have done the other way around. But anyway, um, let's say that. That's your, um, that's probably results there. Results, and then you got time, okay? So results and time. So over time, the things that you do, you work, 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 but then you get better results, better results, better results, right? And in order to get the best results, uh, you need to take a lot of action, okay? So you need to take a lot of action. So obviously, you're, you're taking action here. So to get to that level there, it requires a lot of action. All right, so that one one thing is that's one action there, another action there, another action there, but you're not going to get from from here all the way to there without taking any action. All right, so you really do need to take action. You need to do whatever it takes to just take action. So from here to there, obviously your motivation levels is not going to be hundred percent. You know, so maybe I'll show it another way is that over time, okay. So over time, let's let's look at motivation. Okay, so so that's the results there, but let's look at motivation. So obviously your results, results and motivation, same thing. So it's, it's a level 10, that's a level one, right? If you work hard, you might get level 10 results, work, don't work as hard, you get level one results. But also in terms of motivation, motivation could be a level 10, and motivation could be a level nine. But you know, when you're starting a new project, your motivation, as you know, it's really high, right? But then, as you know, it go, it declines over time. So over time, it just declines, okay? But if you get results, your motivation goes back up again. So one thing I found is that um, during the times when your motivation is low and you're not getting the results that you want, this is the area in which you have to watch out for right here. When you're not getting many results, you're not getting many results, and your motivation is very low. You don't can't can't do it because there's sometimes when you take massive action, you're doing all these things, and you're not getting results that you want, right? But the most important thing is that you still have to keep taking action because what happens if we stop the process right here? Okay, let's say that we stop right here. Okay, I decide to. Okay, I'm not. Uh, I was motivated at the start, right? But now my motivation is really low and my motivation is very low, I'm not taking that much action, and I'm getting results, and I feel like I wanna quit here. A lot of people wanna quit here. So heaps of people wanna quit here. So this is the area that's really important right here. This is like the uh, the dead zone, I call this the dead zone, okay? So basically what it is is that no matter what happens, you're not motivated and you're t still taking action, but there's no results. So obviously when you go in this dead zone, when it's a long period of time, this could take months and unfortunately could actually take years. But the thing is that in order to get to the next level, which is a lot of results, you need to actually be taking a lot of actions. So for example, um, like let's say for example, uh, you want to lose weight and get six pack abs. 
how many times do you have to go to the gym to do that how many times do you have to uh you know work out and count your calories and so forth there's quite a lot of things that you have to do right in order to get those abs or if you want to build a real estate empire how many things do you need to do to get that empire you need to buy how many properties each of those properties requires tons and tons and tons of action what about study tons and tons of action so in order to get the higher results i think that you need to take you know like tons so you got to take tons and tons of action um and that's the only way to get to that level there but in order to in order to get that result that you want you need to take action and you can't depend on motivation alone because if you depend on motivation then like if your motivation is low and therefore you're not going to take any action then therefore you're not going to get to that result that you want so the trick is to identify that those times when you're not motivated which is bound to always happen you need to remember that to always show up you need to continually show up remember that quote no matter if you doesn't matter if your eyes are bleeding no matter how tired you are unmotivated you are whatever whatever it is you just got to keep showing up and um if you keep showing up just making the phone call sending the emails doing the content you know keep posting even if you're not getting results just keep posting keep doing it keep doing it keep doing it and eventually you'll get out of that dead zone and you'll be able to accelerate results because those actions that you take right now is going to actually help in future and your future self requires those actions you know so your future um, self needs those actions that you take right now it doesn't need the, the your motivation you know so i think that most important thing is you always have to show up always remember no matter what you're going through right now if you're pushing hard, taking massive action and nothing's working, keep showing up, just keep showing up. And uh, if your motivation level is really low, you can do other things such as watch really cool motivational videos and, and listen to audio stuff or whatever it is. But you can do those type of things, but don't determine your actions dependent on your motivation because if your action is dependent on how you feel, then, you know, then, then you're not gonna get the results that you want. You need to be able to be able to take action despite how you feel. And you can see from the graph that that's the way it works. So um, really hope that this video helps you somehow. And uh, let me know how you guys go in the comments. I'm really keen to hear from you. And let me know. So please subscribe to this channel. See you guys next one. Cheers.